Welcome back. Well, if you're looking for a hot melt system that's going to give you strength, versatility, and speed, look no further than PamTite here with Matt. Matt, I tell you what, very impressed with this because we're going to be able to wrap all of that into this gun right here with your special glue, and we're going to be saving time, and as you know, in these days, time is money. Tell us a little bit about your company. Well, time is everything. We've been at this for about three years, and we're a German-based company. We do all of the marketing and sales in North America, and what we have here that's really changed our business is we designed a specialty adhesive, and we decided to put it into a half-inch stick. So the reason we did that is because everybody knows that a half inch stick is very easy to work with. So it runs through a basic glue gun, the gun heats up in five minutes, and so you're able to work very quickly and easily. Well, that five minutes that you happen to mention is really the kind of time that you're talking about. You know, typically if we're using a construction adhesive or in another hot melt system, we're talking between, you know, maybe up to 24 hours before that glue will set. We're talking a matter of minutes here, is that correct? Right, so what's, what's really special about this product is that we are a suitable replacement for many of the tube adhesives and construction adhesives that are out there. So with this product you have the strength characteristics of tube adhesives, but it sets up much more quickly. So you may be used to using a product that takes anywhere between 12 and 24 hours to set up. This not only grabs the substrate immediately as soon as you stick it together, but it's fully cured in five minutes. So if you're doing uh, tack strips or if you're putting down starter rows for hardwood, you don't have to glue the pieces together and come back later that day or even the next day. You can put the pieces together and in five minutes complete the job. And that's really going to streamline our whole operation. We're going to be able to move on to that next job and put more money in our pocket instead of maybe tra traveling 25, 50 miles back out to that job site the next day. Exactly. There's a lot of cost wrapped up for the installer in going back to the job site, traveling, you know, when he could be at the next job doing, you know, performing the next task. Well, you know, talking about uh, laying hardwood floors, that starter board, um, if we can get that down right away, and it sounds like this is going to be dry within five minutes, by the time we're finished with that long starter board, we can come back and actually start laying flooring. Exactly. So the way it's currently done, a lot of times, since you can't comfortably fit a nailer up against those starter rows, oftentimes a construction adhesive is used. So when those are put down, you have to wait and kind of tiptoe around the area to make sure you don't upset the boards while they're being uh, while the glue is curing in place so with this system you simply apply the glue to the board stick it down it's immediately held in place in five minutes you're ready to finish the job well I tell you what that has to be music to everybody's ears out there right oh, now so. knowing that we can get right to work and this is really ultra green too very low VOC so there's really not going to be much in the way of off gas Exactly. So one of the things that's very noticeable with tube adhesives is they have a very strong noxious odor when they're using. So um, a lot of times you want to wear a mask or you know be in a ventilated area while you're using these products. Uh, this product has no odor when you use it. It has extremely low VOC content, so it's much safer to work with uh, compared with some of the other adhesives that are out there. Now we've only talked really about flooring, but this has so many different applications throughout uh, the entire house, no matter what kind of construction work we're doing. That's right. So in a nutshell, this product sticks to just about anything. Now, of course, you know, you want to try it before you do a whole job to make sure that it works. But products that are typically very hard to adhere together, so plastics, metal, glass, ceramic tiles, anything that's glossy, this product works on all of it. As long as it's inside your house, you can use it day in, day out. Now, speaking of demonstrations, who are we going to be meeting to kind of run us through what this actually works on? We're going to meet with Bill Struther. He's our marketing manager for Hot Melt Systems at PAM, and he'll walk through some of the uh, common applications. Easy enough. Well, Matt, thank you so much for being on. Thank you, Bill. Nice to meet you. Joining me right now is Bill Struther, and Bill, Matt did a great job in whetting our appetite. This is going to be able to be our new best friend, helping us with all kinds of construction. And in front of us right here, you have a threshold, a starter board, um, you have a tack strip, ceramic tile, wood. Uh, give us a little bit of an idea what is going to be sticking to what and how long it will last. Okay. We're going to start out with our uh, original innovation which was bonding tack strips to finished concrete. Uh, prior to this getting started, uh, installers are waiting 24 hours. With Pam Tight, which is a non-toxic glue, we can do it instantly and you can power stretch in five minutes. 
Amazing. So uh, we're actually going to put some on the back side of the tag strip here. And, um, and it looks like you're just putting on an average amount, That's right. covering the whole thing, and then you set it down. Put an eighth inch bead down, and all you need is one continuous line. You can do a four foot, five foot tack strip, or you can cut the strip up. It's really up to the uh, individual installer. And once we got the tack strip down and we were selling it, we asked our customers, think out of the tack strip. So you remember the old commercial, think out of the bun, okay? So now from the tack strip, they said, well, gee, if we can do that, we can do a transition strip. Oh, very cool. And just as easy, you put it down, stick it across your threshold, and you're ready to go. It's so much easier because, in many cases, you can eliminate the use of fasteners. And also, it's ergonomically, it's very good for the installers because they avoid a, any carpal tunnel problems. Now, how long do you have to reposition it? That's like, ah, oh, that's it. Well, you have a minute open time. Minute. If, you, if you decide you want to, you've got it lined up and you're ready, you can put pressure on it immediately and it'll start setting. Okay. But if you just leave it, it'll take about a minute to set. I do recommend you put a minimum amount of pressure as you get closer to that, uh, that one minute open time. Okay, so far we've done a tack strip, uh, some brass, and in front of us we have ceramic tile and wood. Right. Let me just get very basic here. Uh, a lot of people would prefer not using fasteners because of the cosmetics. So just as an example, you can see the quarter round molding. Right. Um, it looks like uh, that's going to be glued up as well. Right. And for example, I've done my entire kitchen this way with no fasteners. And we're going to have a little show of strength here. I will show you. Now that's amazing. Yeah, it just it goes and goes. So now after we get done with these applications, we say, what else can this do? Hardwood flooring, your first two strips against the wall and your last two where you can't fit the hardwood nail in. Well, let me ask you about that, Bill. Is there a way, I mean, sometimes there's gaps underneath those boards. Is, is this going to be as suitable to fill in those gaps as well? Yes, it works to fill out the hollow spots. We change the nozzles and use more of a needle nose nozzle, which allows the glue to go down, fill up the hollow spot, and in a very rapid fashion. And uh, it's, it's very, as you know, the glue gun has so many applications that really all you need is this and you can change the nozzle and, and do other things. Now let's say uh, we get a little bit of glue squirting out between a couple of boards. Is it stainable or paintable? It is stainable and paintable both. Very cool. Now what do you have here? I've just got a piece of vinyl flooring. In case, you know, you have areas where you don't get enough glue down, the job's already done, or you get a call back. Okay? okay, or you're a homeowner and you see, you know, that vinyl's popping up, let me go fix it. With Pam Tight, it's a wonderful honeydew tool because nobody in your family has to wait, not even your wife. <laughs> so you grab your piece, you put your glue on, and uh, Pam Tight does its work right away. Exactly. And there's no odor, no smell, nothing toxic. It's approved for indirect food contact. Now, I notice you have a piece of tread over there as well. What are we going to be sticking that to? Well, what we, as far as the stair tread is concerned, you can use Pam Tight for the, the bottom and the top. And many times these come up all the time. The Pam Tight will give you instant bonding and quick repair. It's going to be around for 20 plus years. A long time. <laughs> and it's just as easy. You put it on both sides. And in this case, you're going to be adhering it to stone or a brick. Right. I'm going to show you the brick. And you can see right there you've got it that is amazing and a nice tight seal as well which is really good no gaps or wobbles exactly smooth out and let me say also uh, many times for backsplashes you don't want to get the grout and the thin set and everything out so you can do ceramic tile it's very good on ceramic tile in fact it's so good I'll show you something so you take out the uh the Pam tight. Pam tight. And just to make this the most challenging application, we will go gloss, double glo glaze, double gloss, the double gloss. And you can see. Just amazing. So if it can stick to that, it's going to stick to everything. Yeah, it pretty much. Just amazing. You know, this is like a magic show. <laughs> well, it is. People say, you get paid for this? Oh, yeah. Let me uh, show you another little trick here. Uh, we 
don't really have many applications for bricks, but just to show you the pure strength of Pamtite and what it'll do, I want you to remember this. Okay. Brick to brick, maybe? Yes. And bricks sometimes a little bit porous as well, so uh, this is really going to be almost the ultimate test. That's correct. Just hold it down, you put a little pressure on it. Increase, Same one minute time frame window? Right, as I put pressure on well this is 30 seconds. Here we go folks. Wow, that is amazing. Now, you know, I don't want this to be boring for anybody, so let's push the envelope one more time. All right, and what do you have in your hand right there, Bill? What I have is a piece of glass, like a tile. Okay. And what we're going to do is put this on and pick the brick up almost immediately. Wow, that had uh, less than two seconds to actually set, and you picked up all of that weight with the brick. And with that done right now, Bill, I know you have to have the attention of all of our viewers out yes. there. What is the best way for them to learn more about Pam Type? Come to pamfast.com on our website on the internet, and you will learn all about it and uh, contact us. We'll be glad to tell you where you can buy it uh, from your local distributor. Easy enough. Bill, thank you so thank much, you much for Bill. being on. Goodbye. Thanks.